Now to that tense standoff in Hell's Kitchen. Asylum seekers who had been staying at the Watson Hotel are refusing the city's effort to move them to a new temporary facility. They're refusing to go to the Brooklyn Cruise Terminal. Instead, they are opting to camp outside along 57th Street. Eyewitness News reporter Stefan Kim is there live with the very latest. Stefan. Well, Shirlene, dozens of migrants said they were not backing down, and after two nights sleeping in the cold, they are still here. Single adult, adult male migrants are being moved to the Brooklyn Cruise Terminal so that migrants' families with children can move into the Watson Hotel. This morning, the city's immigration commissioner met with migrants. He asked them to come see the terminal with them to see for themselves. Migrants are refusing to, set, to go, saying the conditions there are inhumane and too remote of a location. To address those concerns, the mayor last night released this video of his tour of the facility saying it's warm and heated showing off the cots they've laid out but it is a congregate setting and that is among the migrants objections I went to Brooklyn and I returned it's uninhabitable there was no heat and nothing nearby everything is far away Now, meanwhile, meanwhile, migrants have agreed to send five of them with the commissioner. He's about to board this MTA bus moments from now to check out that facility in Brooklyn. By the way, all morning long, we've seen several MTA buses filled with migrants taking off for that Brooklyn facility. There is a rally also this afternoon with faith leaders supporting these migrants.